look who is here someone's daddy how are you doing i'm fine wow he looks so much like me yeah he has your eyes i can't believe i am already a father thank you so much what are you thanking me for for carrying and betting my child even though i know we didn't plan for it but it's eventually a blessing oh come on it's nothing i will arrange for you to leave that place i don't like the behavior you live in and i wouldn't like my son to grow up there i will arrange for a better place and also hire the best nanny that will help you nurse the child your allowance will also be increased thank you so much this is too much i don't know how to thank you nothing is too much for my son and also for the woman who brought him to the world thank you so much stanley i really appreciate i will be right back i want to see the doctor for a minute yes he's gradually on his way to becoming mine your daddy is going to be all ours and did i forget to tell you that your daddy is a multi-billionaire yes he is sweetheart so you came into the right place sweetheart it's a boy what is a boy i don't get sandra just gave birth to a boy oh um sweetheart i am sorry about everything i didn't plan to have a child with another woman that isn't you but the child is innocent and a child is still a blessing regardless of the circumstances surrounding the beds i promise i will make it up to you you're right i'm happy for you but how sure are you that the child is yours the child looks so much like me but i am not that stupid i have conducted a dna test and the results will be coming out soon but to be honest the child looks a lot like me so i have a feeling the baby is mine Well, let's not be too sure until the result comes out. You are right. Sweetheart, I want you to promise me that even if the child is yours, it won't take you away from me. Never. Please, I don't want you to have such thoughts ever again. I am all yours. I went to see the doctor today as usual, and he says I have a higher chance of conceiving. He says I can start trying with my husband now. Really? Yes. Then what are you waiting for? Let's go and try right away. <laughs> you are not serious. I am. There is nothing that will make me more happier than having a baby with my wife. Same here. So what are we waiting for? Let's go make some babies. Of course. Good morning, sir. Your meeting with Mr. Wright and his team is slated for 1 p.m. this afternoon, and the MD has already finished preparing the presentation for the meeting. Okay, please call me Hendy on your way out. Dr. Lewis also asked me to give this to you. He is mine. I knew it. He looks so much like me for him not to be mine. So I am really a father. Wow. I ought to start acting more responsible. You sent for me. Yes. My PA and secretary just told me that you have finished preparing the presentation for today's meeting. Yes, I will bring it to you in the next few minutes. Before you do that, um I I, I wanted to tell you once again that I am sorry. Please, if it's not business, I don't want to hear it. I have told you times that number that our conversation should be not in but business. If not how things are, I would have even left your company for you. Please don't push me to leave. I have forgiven you but we can't be friends as before. I also wanted to tell you that I am now your father. Oh, congratulations then. I'll be in my office. Shit. So you mean to tell me that your millionaire baby father got to this place? Yes, so I couldn't believe it myself. But here is it. Babe, you don't have mao. I beg, hope say you never forget your girl. How will I ever forget you? You be my number one. So where's our baby Jare? He's asleep. Hey, yeah, I've missed him. He sleeps a lot. So when are you going to make the move of making Stanley yours and yours alone? It's one step at a time. This baby is really going to bring us together. 
He's already always coming here all the time. Damn, babe, you're the most mischievous bitch I've ever known. I know, right? Hello, Wakey. Wakey. Happy birthday, sweetheart. Oh my goodness. I totally forgot. Yeah, I got you this. I know it's not what you're expecting, but please, manage it for now. I will make it up to you next time. You know things are not okay for me now. Caleb, what is this? I thought we agreed that you get me a new car. Yes, but it's not possible now that I don't have a job. To be honest, I'm just tired of this marriage. I'm not even close to my peers in any ramification. Yes, we might not be close to your friends in material things, but the love I have for you is unbeatable. It's not enough, Caleb. Love is not enough. It's not love that is going to make me a billionaire's wife. What rubbish. Sophia, you did not just do that, did you? Sophia, Sophia. Oh my God, what did I just do? What exactly has gotten into me? I shouldn't have said that to Caleb. He tries his best and I know he would have done better if he had enough money. It was even my fault that he lost his job and yet, look at the way I treated him. Gosh, I've gotten myself into a very deep shit and I don't know how I'm going to come out of this. Caleb doesn't deserve me at all. He doesn't. Sweetheart, where are you going to by this time of the night? I am so sorry, sweetheart, but I have to go see my son. Sandra just called me to come over immediately. But it's late. You can't be leaving for Sandra's house by this time. Does that mean you'll be sleeping over? Apparently. Charlie! Sweetheart, relax. I have promised you that there's nothing between me and Sandra. Nothing can ever happen between us. But you are sleeping over at her place. I am staying with my son and not with her. Baby, you promised me that this baby won't come in between us. But you are breaking your promise. You are mostly at her house. I am mostly at her house doesn't mean I have anything to do with her. I am just there to see my son. I know you are not happy because the child isn't yours, but he is mine and I have to be there for him all the time as his father. And what's that supposed to mean? That you need to get used to this and put your jealousy aside. I have to go now. I will see you later. Good night. Wow.